Even though it may be off the beaten path for most of us, it's almost impossible not to notice the massive growth along Mobile's waterfront. The Alabama Port Authority has been investing and expanding and upgrading its shipping service at a time when the world's supply chain needs it most. Now we have the numbers to prove it. Today, NBC 15's Darwin Singleton spoke with the man in charge and came away with a new appreciation for America's fastest growing port. Port officials have known the numbers are looking good at Alabama's only deep water port, but when Port Director John Driscoll saw the numbers from an impact study by consulting firm Martin Associates, even he was caught off guard. Would you say they surprised you or were you saying, okay, I hope they come in looking like this and... They surprised me. Candidly, they, they were surprising because they were so strong. The numbers look at the port's 2021 performance as compared to numbers taken two years earlier tripling the port's economic impact during that time, delivering $85 billion in value to the state, creating a whopping 215% increase in overall economic impact and a 225% increase in tax revenue, creating $2 billion for state and local governments in just two years. Now that is the kind of growth that gets people's attention. The main drivers of the, that is really the container traffic that you had mentioned previously. That's uh, that's grown significantly, right? With the port being uh, the fastest growing container port in terms of percentages in the United States for over the past five years. But perhaps the numbers that will hit home with most Alabama residents are the job numbers. A massive 94% jump in port jobs in just two years, helping to create nearly 313,000 jobs in Alabama. That's one in every seven jobs in the state. So yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's about 14% of the, uh, the jobs that we have in the state, it touches one way or the other. And as the Mobile Ship Channel is dredged and widened, expect those numbers to continue to rise, a work in progress that keeps more people working throughout Alabama. Darwin Singleton, NBC 15 News.